everyone's friend Whichever world I go, I just blend All languages I speak, no doubt I'm so unique I listen to their stories, I share some of mine And when I gain some knowledge, my antenna shines <laughs> I am an alien, I'm everyone's friend The Stag's Antlers Gugu was passing by when it saw a frog seated by the pond and looking at its reflection in the water. The frog did not seem happy about what it saw in the water and its displeasure was quite evident on its face. When Gugu asked the frog what the matter was which made him look as unhappy as he did, the frog told him that he did not like his feet which were rather ugly. Gugu tells a story to the frog. Once upon a time, there lived in another forest a stag who was slender and tall with antlers that were beautiful for everyone to behold. The stag was rather proud of its antlers and would never miss an opportunity to look at itself in the lake and admire itself. One day, when it went to the lake for a drink of water, it looked at its legs and thought that it was not so good looking. It somehow did not like the lean structure of its legs which did not look attractive. But the stag looked at its antlers once again and thought that it is okay to have such legs because its antlers were what would capture people's attention. It was happy that it looked beautiful. While it was continuing to admire itself, it could hear some footsteps in the background. At once, it knew that it was the hunters coming in search of it and started running away from there. The legs that it so despised helped it run fast, really very fast, until such time that it was soon out of the sight of the hunters. The stag felt much relieved to be at a safe distance, but was feeling rather tired for having run so far. It decided to rest a while and carefully looked around for a place to hide while it rested. It saw a tree beneath which it could hide itself and it quickly went behind it and hid itself which it rested a while. Soon it could again hear the steps of the hunters at a distance. It quickly wanted to move away from there when it realised that its antlers had got stuck in the branches of the tree. As hard as it tried, it could not pull itself away and was stuck there until an arrow from the hunter struck it and it died on the spot. So Gugu tells the frog that it is not about beauty one should be concerned, but more about the utility.